got a new spring, more cool air today, but when will it warm up? Jacob Boss has the forecast. We will have a look at the full night of sports from last night. All this and more on this Tuesday, May 19th, 2015. Good afternoon, SHS. I'm Tyler Knudsen. And I'm Tanner Ellison. Let's take a look at those announcements for today. There will be a short meeting in the Sammy Center during advisory time tomorrow for all students planning to play football in the fall. There will be a high school boys and girls cross country meeting for next fall today at 3.30 in room 408. If you are interested in going out, please be there for important information. The meeting will last about 15 minutes. If you can't make it, please see Coach Hines. The student council will be selling ice cream the next three days during lunch to raise money to send Abby Wilson to her beauty pageant. This is after the Starlet send-off dance to raise money was for, her, for her was canceled last week. The final FCA meeting of the year will be tonight at 8.30 p.m. in Mr. Schmidt's room. There will be cake, and we will send off the seniors. If you registered for journalism this fall, please check your email for a message from Mrs. Sirk. And now we bring Jacob Voss back in with us for the weather. How are you doing today, Jacob? Good. Still kind of cold from last night. It was pretty chilly. It was pretty chilly last night. We had a record low temperature uh, last this morning, actually. And not last night, actually. So, okay. so um, yeah, pretty cold out there. Yeah. We're continuing with that a little bit today. I'm going to bring my long johns back out just to get to my car this morning. I had to scrape off the windshield. I had to scoop the driveway. Yeah, we had a... Uh, we had the... Uh, Air conditioning on in our house, so oh, it's that's freezing. Nice. Yeah, so I got home and I had to turn the heat on. Yeah, it's still pretty cool out there today. We'll go and talk about that. You know, and see what's going on. And talk about those record lows. We actually set a record low before midnight, and we set one after midnight. So there's two new record lows. The previous record low was 36 degrees in 2002. We hit 35 this morning. Take a look at tonight and tomorrow morning. Some isolated showers will be possible. The system's mainly going to be to our south, but maybe just a couple isolated storms moving up in our area tonight into tomorrow morning. But otherwise, not a big deal. Looking at what to expect this afternoon, 55 degrees there at 4 o'clock, increasing clouds throughout the afternoon tonight, and that's going to bring in that rain for tonight with northeast winds 5 to 10 miles an hour, high 55 degrees today with those north winds, not quite as bad as yesterday, but still 10 to 20 miles an hour out there. And as we take a look at the seven day forecast, you do see we're warming up for Thursday and Friday, 72 and 73 degrees there. Cooling down just a little bit for the weekend, more storm chances every day for your Memorial Day weekend. So we'll continue to watch that. The best chance looks to be on Sunday, but for now, back to you guys. Now we'll toss it over to Tanner Sports. The JV varsity boys soccer teams were down in Western Christian last night and the cold evening would begin with a 5-2 loss for the JV team. The varsity team would keep the game scoreless in the first half, but Western would put three up in the second half. SLPO's only goal came on a PK and they fell last night 3-1. to one. Tonight a senior night at home versus MLC Floyd Valley. And it was senior night last night at home for the girls soccer team taking on Western Christian. The game would be tied 3-3 at the end of the regulation. The game would go through two overtimes with no score. The game went to PKs and Western would win, making all their PKs 4-3. District golf meets were held in the cold weather yesterday. No boys' results were available, but the girls' team took third place overall with 415 points. Top scores included Lauren Laven with a 99 and Abby Doolin with a 101. All individuals in the team ended their season last night. Let us look at your sports. Back to you, Tyler. That's all the time we have for you today, SLHS. Thank you for watching Newsbreak. Have a great day.